Welcome back to Summit Sunrise. I'm here in the studio with Erin from Red Buffalo. Erin, how are you doing I'm today? I'm doing very well. I'm doing great now because Erin brought me a wonderful treat as always. We like to hear that from people. Love it's like, it. I'm better after my Red Buffalo. <laughs> I look forward to this every Monday morning. And so what is this? The Nutty Professor, the but what Nutty is Professor it? The Nutty Professor Latte. It's one of our signature drinks. It is a white chocolate macadamia nut latte with cinnamon and nutmeg. Actually named after one of our uh, good friends up here. He's a fifth grade science teacher at one of the elementary schools. And he kind of helped us come up with this. We're like, science, professor. So that's the fun part about Red Buffalo is that you, there's a history behind everything. We're such a local shop. You know, if the, our blackboard, our menus written on, came from the old Silverthorne Elementary School. So there's, there's a history oh, behind everything. Cool. And that's what makes small coffee shops, whether you're right. visiting in Summit or wherever you are, there's always a story with a small place. And you always allow too, where you can come in and they can create whatever they want or think of. And Absolutely. I love, like, you have the Nutty Professor. You also have my one of my favorites, the Nutella, the Smokestack. Smokestack smoke latte. latte. Say that a few times smoke fast. Stack. So they have great, creative, unique drinks, yes. which I love. You also like, have teas. We do have teas. We have a whole selection, over 30 different types of loose leaf tea. And if you haven't tried loose leaf tea, you really need to. It's just kind of changes the whole perspective. I think some people say, oh, I drink tea because I can't drink coffee or I don't like coffee. Loose leaf tea, even a coffee lover who like, I come in and get a double espresso and that's it, they'll love loose leaf tea. It's just, I'd like to compare it with like a good micro brew versus like Keystone Light. So your tea bag is gonna be your Keystone Light and then your micro brew is gonna, or your, your loose leaf tea is gonna be like a really good micro brew, something right. from like your local brewery sort of thing. And it is good, I've had a few years now and I love every single one of them. Yes. And you also have the Tea of the Month Club. It's a really fun thing, especially if you're thinking about Valentine's Day coming up, which is hard to avoid because the moment Christmas was over, the grocery stores turned everything over to Valentine's Day. <laughs> but it's a great gift. You can actually buy it on our website, which is redbuffalocafe.com. It's a six-month subscription where you get two one-ounce samples of tea every month for six months. It's about enough tea for a cup of tea every day. And it's just a great way to say, I'm thinking of you the whole time. Or you can get it for yourself, try out all, you get to try 12 new teas. Right. And it's great, we give a little description about what each tea, um, and it's really fun, because we have some really good teas. We have the, last week you tried the caramel toffee puer. Oh, so good. Um, we have some people who just love, I know the station manager here loves the coconut truffle. She says it tastes like a Samoa cookie. It does um, taste like, I had that one too. Yeah. So it's just all sorts of fun things. And of course, goodies too. You come in, we have pastries and breakfast burritos and smoothies. Um, so it's just, it's kind of your, your one-stop place to either come and relax and get work done because we have free wireless internet. We have a printing, vaccine, scanning station. Um, and we have some books and some uh, for sale from the, from the Summit County Libraries. Rocking chairs. It's just a good place to come and enjoy. Yeah, family setting. Friendly. Yeah. And you also, you have the location is amazing yes, right on the river. Yes, we talked about that. Yes. 358 Blue River Parkway in Silverthorne. So out the back door, 20 feet is the Blue River. At the front door, you have, as you see right there, beautiful views of the Gore Range. Our namesakes, Buffalo Mountain and Red Mountain, are right there. And, you know, I'm not sure if anyone saw the traffic going down to Denver yesterday, but I know it's going to be... I heard about it. It's going to be like that all winter long, I imagine, Sunday. So why not wait a little bit, come into Red Buffalo, because we're just a half a mile off of that interstate exit. Right. So come relax. Um, we're happy to check seat out for you, let you know if it's moving or not, if they stopped doing the metering or uh, a car read a meeting. book. Try read a out. book. The coffees, try your tea. Or if you do need to sit in the traffic, get something that you really want. We do have soy and almond milk. So at least you can have your drive down to the Front Range Beach. Be more enjoyable. A little bit more enjoyable. Yes. And you guys, you do a lot to support the community too, which I think is really important. We so do. We need to support, support, support you as well then. Yes, we have a big um, thing that we're doing coming up. Also, the town of Silverthorne has their Twilight Ice Skate. It's up on North Pond. They don't have rentals for ice skates. So be bring your own. Um, we'll be donating hot chocolate. There's other... Uh, catering company is going to be doing soups and other, uh, I think it's a chili as well, and cookies. And that starts 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. this Sunday, the 19th. And it's just so fun. I think we had over 300 people come out last year, and they're just skating around right around twilight and having a really good time. It should be full moon-ish around that time. So that if you want some free so hot chocolate fun. from Red Buffalo, we'll yeah. be donating hot chocolate for that. And there'll be other. I can imagine your hot chocolate's going to be amazing because it's your delicious. Amazing. Yeah, so come on down. It's a fun community event. Silverthorne has some really fun things that they do that are really just for the community. That are free events, and um, you can really take advantage of some of the great things they have to offer. Yeah, and you guys also support the environment too. We said that earlier in the show. Yes. Everything you do, zero waste, and we're zero waste. We, uh, yeah, all of our appliances, our Energy Star, all of our lights. We've 
upgraded to all the best lighting. We have LED lights, which, yeah, they're more expensive per bulb, but they're gonna last longer. They use four watts per light bulb as opposed to 12, and it's just, it's, it's amazing what, what you can really do when you kind of sit down and look at your energy stuff. High Country Conservation Center, they can do an energy audit. They did an energy audit for us. They can help you know where you can cut down and then go above and beyond. They help us kind of set up our, our zero waste and composting program. So overall, Red Buffalo is just an amazing place, and by supporting them, you're supporting a whole lot more as well. So yes. everyone check it out. It's 358 Blue River Parkway here in Silverthorne. Um, Aaron will be... We'll be there. To help you out. We're happy to help you. Pick out something great for you. Yes. Well, thank you for joining us. Thanks for having we'll me. We'll be back with more to come on Summit Sunrise.